The question of who killed 19-year-old Diane Olkowitz in 1966 and 14-year-old Terry Erdman in 71 could soon be answered. Olkowitz stabbed more than 100 times at her workplace in Menominee Falls. Erdman stabbed roughly 60 times, found in a field on Milwaukee's northwest side. Police, working for years to solve the case, may have cracked it. This search warrant shows that police came here to Holy Cross Cemetery to dig up the body of a man who died in 2008. At the time, police sent this questionnaire to delivery companies with delivery contracts for the metal company where Olkwitz worked. The company said the man made a pickup at the metal company days before her murder. WISN 12 News is not naming him because he has not been charged. Police tied the two cases together using the killer's DNA found on both victims' bodies. Now police are working to find out if that DNA matches the man they unearthed in July. Police used DNA from his brother who passed and a son who voluntarily gave up his DNA. We knocked on his son's door Thursday evening, but he didn't answer. Police say his DNA profile shows similarities to the DNA found on one of the women and he may be his son. A doctor gathered remains with DNA for police. The warrant filed July 18th was sealed for months, just unsealed Thursday. Milwaukee police will not share if the DNA from the crimes match the man dug up or any other information relating to the case until next week. In Milwaukee, James Stratton, WISN 12 News.